question. When I was a sophomore in college, I was taking a sociology class and, and the professor said, uh, uh, I'll give extra credit for anyone who does an internship uh, in Cabrini Green. And uh, I didn't know what Cabrini Green was. It turned out it was a, a housing project in Chicago that was notorious for, you know, violence and, um, and so, uh, but I heard extra credit and so I raised my hand and I said, I'll do it. You should stick with your, your training. And so what I am is I'm a storyteller and a listener and, and people really find a lot of, uh, it's incredible how much power people take from having their stories heard and having a chance to give voice to their experiences. You know, you'd think it would be um, debilitating for them but it's empowering. So people love the experience of, of someone just sitting and, and just, just listening. You know, yesterday I met with dozens and dozens of students who said, this was my story and I've never been able to talk about it and I've always felt so ashamed. So how do we bring those students in, into the community? How do we make sure their experiences are valorized and, and that, that don't, they don't carry around that shame? Uh, one way to do that is to, is to let them know they're not alone. <laughs> Well, I think the most important thing is to form relationships with each other, right? A lot of times students who are struggling, um, I mean, they, they write to us. <laughs> we had several NC State students write, on, write to us on our website yesterday. Yeah, talking about what, what visions for the future and, and uh, you know, their determination to change things. Uh, it was very exciting, you know, like right after the event, people were writing into the website and, and sharing their views. but. Um, Forming relationships is, is really, really important. You know, what I think is most remarkable is that the university has committed itself to this theme, exploring this theme uh, for the year. <laughs> and I don't know of another place that's doing that. I'm, there probably are, but um, I've been to a lot of college campuses. And they may have a food hunger day um, but, you know, this is, this is impressive. I know there are also uh, activities afoot to really address homelessness among, uh, among students at NC State. So, it's cool. It's a, it's a, it was an eye-opening and encouraging visit.